Over in Cheatham County, a community group has gotten together to take in donations for neighbors in the east in need right now. Jackson Pigeon is live from Tractor Supply in Ashland City, where those collection efforts are happening right now. Jackson. Good morning, Nikelia. Yeah, these folks here have been talking with officials and residents in East Tennessee to see what they're most in need of, sometimes even going to Facebook. But I'm going to step out of the way so you can see what they're doing here. So they're trying to pack this 53-foot trailer full of goods by Wednesday morning. Things such as bottled water, canned food, dog food, toiletries, laundry detergent, batteries, blankets, and new clothing. They even have a team on site, so you can just pull up to Tractor Supply here in Ashland City, and they'll unload your donations for you. They're also accepting monetary contributions. I spoke with Chastity Short, who is one of the four people behind this donation drive. She tells me we are at the volunteer state for a reason, and now is the time to step up and support our eastern neighbors. Well, they've never experienced anything like this before. It's not like something that they have to deal with every year and are used to. So all of their, everything's exhausted out there. All of their manpower, they're still rescuing people. They're still trying to find areas for people to go. And everybody has just left their homes with just the clothes on their backs. And they'll be here at Tractor Supply in Ashland City until 6 o'clock tonight. They'll be here again tomorrow starting at 10 in the morning until 6 o'clock tomorrow night as well. And then Wednesday morning, they're hoping to take off with this trailer full of goods. Live in Ashland City, Jaxi Pigeon, News 2. It's going to take a long time for countless communities to recover from Helene's impact. Stay with us. Coming up in less than five minutes, we'll have a full report from ABC News on the national response and damage across the region.